said most I would say everybody that's in a sorority and a fraternity has made that their idol. It is made that their comfort. It's made that their open door. It's made that what they rely on. It's what they use as a crutch. God is out of the picture, even if they identify as a Christian. Now, the goal I want everybody to do, since most people joined the fraternity or sorority 20, 10, 15 years ago, right? I want you to go back to the declaration you made. I want you to go back to the oath, the vow, and the pronouncements that you made when you got there. I want you to open up the Bible and I want you to read them side by side. And I want you to, I want you and your Holy Ghost, you say you have the spirit of truth to judge and say, honestly, the the pronouncements I made with this organization should have only been made to God. Mm. And only if you have the spirit of truth and not the spirit of error or the spirit of offense, because you're not offended with me, you're offended with God, that you will say, I am not only going to denounce this sorority um, in prayer, let heaven and earth record this day, I denounce my affiliation with this sorority and fraternity and this Freemason Association and Eastern Star Association, but I'm also going to write a letter of denouncement. Well, um, fortunately, there's a generation of people who have been coming out of these organizations of believers, young believers, older believers, after they do what I said, they write out, they pull out the, what they vowed 20, 20 years ago, they pull out the Bible and say, oh my gosh, I made a vow to an organization that I should have only made to God, right? They've been coming out. Well, recently the organizations have started to say you can you can denounce, but you have to agree to these rules. You have to agree to never talk bad about us. You have to agree to never say what your process was in getting here. Right now they're trying to put this requirement for you to they're trying to make it very hard for you to denounce. And I don't think that God wants you a part of any organization that's gonna make it very hard for you to denounce. That's not God, right? That's not the nature. All right, so here we go. Um, we got we got a few uh, <laughs> Greeks on our team, <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna tread carefully here. Uh, Ryan, how did that hit you? Uh, you got Fifteen minutes, Ryan. Brother, 15. Uh, yeah. So uh, I am part of a Greek organization, grad chapter, Iota Phi Theta Frater uh, Fraternity um, Incorporated, and um, you know what? When I first joined my org, it was more like um, I, I, I tell tell Sean this all the time. It felt no different than being like a Falcons fan or a University of Alabama football fan. Like it's just a fan base, right? Like it's just a group, right? Um, we did do social things around the city. I I, I myself participated in those things, um, but I did get to a really strange place. I got to a strange place. I was at a barbecue, and we were reciting the pledge. And I noticed that there was things in there and I kind of started mumbling words like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and I started just feeling weird. Like I, f I felt like um, there was some, <laughs> I'm just being honest. There were some words in there. There were some words in our pledge uh, to our, to our shield, right. That uh, made me feel um, indifferent about it because we were using words like glory and honor in mm. there. And I've never <laughs> given glory and honor to anything but god and so for for me that was a that was a point that was a turning point for me um as far as like the paraphernalia um the 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 um greets and things like that and the greetings and you know just being with my uh my other associated frat brothers which is my brother-in-law and then mm -hmm. rick sincere mm -hmm. fmg yeah uh, <laughs> don't, 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 don't throw nobody here. in here brother <laughs> don't throw nobody else up in here yeah yeah you're on your own brother and uh, my little sister ciara who's a, a proud <laughs> member did. of alpha five shout out to ciara in the comments alpha, that she doesn't alpha, agree alpha, with her alpha kappa alpha um <laughs> yeah and so my thing is this like you know um oh, man. i'll be honest with you my last chapter meeting was uh the week before I met my wife. Mm. When I met my wife, it was like I had I had another association that I was that I was chasing after. I had a, a another you know, Greek life you're you're in for the family aspect of it as well, right? Like these are my brothers, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to these organization events and things like that. And then it started kind of conflicting with the time that I had available. So yeah, things changed for me then, but um uh I do get what she's saying. And I and I imagine that anybody who takes that challenge might see and feel some some ways that they're going to need to go off and pray. But you know what? It really uh, what really sticks to my heart the most is I remember in reading the Gospels when when Jesus kind of came around and he had told um, Peter and Simon to just give up everything, mm -hmm. right? Just give it all up. Um, 
that's how I feel like that's the one gang that I want to be a part of is the Jesus gang. I want to be a part. If, if I follow anything, if I believe in anything, I want it that to be, I want that to be the example that I leave behind for my children um, and that I, that I that I lead the world with. That's why it was easy for us to drop our affiliation with, you know, mainstream radio. Yeah. And the fact that. I could have been a radio personality on that side versus doing things God's way. But I remember telling my mentor, if I do this, I'm only going to do it to edify God. I won't do it for any other way. So in my life, that's what I model my behaviors, my patterns and what I seek after. So you ready to denounce? <laughs> Are you ready to announce? <laughs> Put him on there's the an official. <laughs> there's an official way to do that that I can't do on air. I, okay. I, I, w- I would want to be respectful to my frat for my frat brothers as well as my line brothers and let them know. You know what I'm saying? Like they still call me for barbecues and cookouts and hanging out and they stuff gonna like stop that. Stop if you if you say that. Yeah, of course, of course yeah, they yeah. will. You ain't done with the game no more. I mean, <laughs> gang bang. They won't call me. They won't call me for those particular reasons. Like it would be weird to have the guy show up that, that, that says y'all not, are sinful and not in par- <laughs> y'all going not, to hell. Not in paraphernalia because this was a whole Greek, you know, gathering that we were supposed to be having. So yeah, but. I'm gonna say this, Ryan. Yeah, go um, ahead. Shout out to what you did, bro. Uh, Thank uh, you. Bro. Uh, that was big I, of you, bro. Yeah, that was kind of sure. big. Um, I will say this. I think what she said that had some valid points to it was your oath in the Bible. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The word of God says, test, test the spirit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And yeah. that's basically what she's saying. Test the spirit of what you're saying that you're vowing to and oath to. And you may not agree with what she's saying. You may, you may not feel it, but what she says, some villain, it, pull out your sheets and test it. It's just the same thing when we talk about with music. Like you say, you like that song? Test it against the word of God. Correct. If yeah. it goes, if it goes <laughs> countercultural to the word of God, then you have some some things where the Lord got to speak to you about. Correct. Yeah, and that's, that's all she's saying. Did to me too. I, I would just music say this. I, I, hey, I've had problems with this since before you even joined, right? <laughs> yeah. So yeah. you've been hearing yeah. my opinion on this for a while. So yeah. I've just seen a lot of weird stuff. That's all I'm gonna say. Um, but. I would just say, just just watch yourself when your natural reaction to somebody saying something is no, no. <laughs> but you like that's a weird thing to do. Like, yeah. just why did you do that? Why did that happen? That's what I would question but myself. I've always been like cautious with you because you feel that way about sports teams too. You try to change the subject. No, 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 no. no I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Like, I know you had a problem when I joined, but you also don't really like when I'm. Wearing, you know, talking about Falcons or you, you, Alabama. You get, you get really like um, deep into belonging to things. I That's like it. I like being able to have a side in the argument. Right. Like yeah. the national championship is going on. I want my team to be there or. It's just it's you know just a caution is just I mean, the Greek thing is way more serious than that. But the caution it is, is um, <laughs> just when you feel like you need to belong to something more than you, the kingdom of God. You know? But I'll be Anything honest with you. Takes like, you away from that. I'll be honest with you, you could talk about the the black letter Greek organizations all you want, but there's also a problem with the American flag and the patriotism. Change the subject again. <laughs> I'm saying, we do I'm that saying, topic too. Okay. Okay. You deflecting. You deflecting. I'm not deflecting because I answered you. I answered no, you. You did a great job, but let's stick on this. I told you my truth. So, <laughs> just from, I've, I've, I know people that have denounced, I know people who are still in it who have yeah. cha- had a change of heart and yeah. they see it differently. I would just want to ask, like, Cut through all of the your your pride in what they do well and yeah. things like that. Are we wrong about it being a little weird? Is is it not a little culty? I'll say is it I'll not a little questionable biblically? Well, are we I, making that up? I'll say I'll say this real quick. I think the reason why it's a belonging. It's a it's almost like your second family. I remember um, years ago in a, in a former church. Um, I remember somebody who was um, in a fraternity, and he said that he was like I would rely more on my brothers than a brother in Christ. Mm. And I was like, because he was so close to the yeah. people. Yeah, the, and, that, and to me, game, I, and, and, and to me, I was like, hey, and, you get, people get hazed and beat up this. to get in. You got colors. I didn't have <laughs> and y'all clicked up. Y'all organized <laughs> gang bang. And we spoke about gang no. bang. Okay, all right. I can, I can explain that part, Jeremiah. When, when we go, when, when I was online, right, they were telling me that your brotherhood is when when you go to these meetings right you introduce yourself to a stranger who obviously is no longer a stranger to you because they're your brother and then they would say hey if you were ever in detroit and you needed a place to sleep 
you don't need to get a hotel. You can call me. Like that, it's just, it's an extension of making you feel like you have an immediate family outside of your immediate family. Mm -hmm. But it's also a good thing. Okay. It's a good I, thing I, because I, listen, listen. when you fall on hard times, I if got you. you fall on that's hard all, times, that's all dope. That's really dope. All of that is cool. But what about the weird stuff? Like if it was just a club that y'all were part of yeah. that was like, hey, these are my guys. That's cool. I don't care about that. The weird stuff, though, the, the pledges, the, the, the mm -hmm. biblical mixing with Greek mythology. Mm -hmm. That's the weird stuff. So I would just say, I know you guys love this stuff, but just be honest with yourself. That's weird. Trickery. That's super weird. I mean, I look at it this way, too. The fact that when you do denounce and then you're excommunicated, right, that, that, mm -hmm. that practice in itself is not of the Lord, right? It's not godly. I mean, the scriptures say by the, by the way they, by how you love each other, you know, that's how we'll know you, right? Mm -hmm. And so if they just going to go ahead and turn it back on you, then like you got to kind of question the root of that practice yeah, yeah, yeah. to begin with, right? Um, I was born and raised Jehovah Witness, mm. okay? Oh, so same okay. thing. I was excommunicated, right? But they say, we, st we love you. How? How you love me? If you don't even talk to me, my own mm. parents, right? So when I look mm. at the root of that organization, they believe in God and Jesus, right? But the root of even that practice right there is a wicked practice. It's a wicked root, you know what I mean? Where you're just going to go ahead and abandon somebody, which is right. not. Rule number one, not of God, right? Exactly. So that's that's kind of where it comes out. to. You say I'm not I'm no longer in this origin. <laughs> yeah. You can't come to the cookout. Can't you come can't to the come cookout. skate. You can't do nothing. No. I don't want to skate with you. I don't, I don't want to go help you. Or they won't help you anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, don't know, I don't know if you can't come to the cookout. You just can't come, you know. With your colors. With the yeah, with, <laughs> with your the paraphernalia, you know, like don't wear the wrong either. colors, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> shout out to all the people that I know that have they have converted it into just a club for themselves, where they ignore the the weird stuff that yeah. we're just nobody seems to want to talk about. I don't yeah. know, keep saying that, y'all not talking about the weird stuff. Well, they but, can't uh, talk about the weird stuff, of course. But, I mean, the weird the stuff. Okay, no, nah, just the, the, the weird. I, I will say this: the weird stuff is more like um, is. <sighs> <laughs> All right, y'all gonna bury me for this. Go ahead. It's more like a mascot. What? It's like it's like that. It's like what? the Georgia Bulldog, right? Like it's more like a mascot. Like when when we do our uh, when we do our. Um, Okay, I can't say you, that. Right. Okay, so using that same <laughs> well, formula, what you're just saying. Can't say, bro. So would you go and <laughs> would, you, would you go to Alabama and get in front of the mascot of Alabama and say, "I pledge my life to you. You, I honor you. I give you glory. I give you this." Would you go in front of that crimson tide? Well, that's, that's not the that's not that. the mascot. Though. I think that's this, what Sean talking about. No, the no, no, no. Stuff. That's different. The, there's a there's you just so, said the mascot. So Iotas have uh, a centaur. Hey, I don't care, man. Right? <laughs> I'm, I'm giving you really got I'm giving one example. Iotas have a centaur, but what? we're talking about their honor and glory is, is talking about the, the shield. It's different. To the, to the club. The shield of the, of the organization. To what y'all stand for. The shield. <laughs> and yeah. shield of faith, is it? We talking so, armor of so God. It, so, <laughs> this, so like we do like this thing called the centaur walk, right? Er, you I'm just you, it's just a it's just a <laughs> bow and then a shield and you just I've been, I've been to pro base. marching I, or whatever. I get, it. I get it. So that's what I'm mm -hmm. saying. Like it's like a mascot, but it is a myth. Uh, uh, what is it? Greek myth? Uh, mythology. It's mythology. It's a demon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yo, I'll just say this. <laughs> but, I'll just say this. Worship, this, but, this <laughs> we gonna get more backlash it on this is. than we did on Beyonce, uh, but it is. on Donald Trump, <laughs> than we did on anything. And so is she. She better watch uh, out. But for it this. is mentioned in the Bible. I think. Uh, but what? but what? mascot. No, but all I'm saying to I, worship I'm, it. No, <laughs> I think which, I, only thing. Exist. Only thing I said is I think the thing that to, to walk away from this for anybody who watching this, <laughs> who watching this, just test it. That's all yeah, she's saying. It's yeah, tested. Yeah. Yeah. We test any other spirit. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, so test so it. When That's I say all it is. when I say testing it is right, but it's like you don't just test it. You got to also determine what those words mean to you. Like, are those words that you have laid up for God? Like, these are words that you laid up, like honor. Glory. That stuff is like, that's only God for me. Mm -hmm. So when I'm saying it about a shield, then I, I had to take a pause and I was like, whoa, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. this is a. Uh, it's weird. <laughs> <All right. laughs> I'll leave, leave y'all alone, y'all. Y'all, I'll leave y'all alone. <laughs>